Welcome back. Well, this week, NBC6 Response is looking at how the cost of living has gone up. This is especially the case when we look at gas prices and how much it's costing us to fill up our tanks. So what's driving the hike and how soon could we see some relief? Here's NBC6 Response, Alina Machado. Perhaps more aggravating than driving in rush hour traffic is having to stop and fill up. It's horrible. It's a pain Kenya and Tim They're absolutely outrageous. and Valentina the prices have gone up so much are learning to live with. I can't pay. I have to pay $60 for this and it was before like 40. According to AAA, the highest gas price averages on record were back in 2008 when they were well over $4 a gallon in our area. We're nowhere near those numbers now, but check out this data from Gas Buddy tracking the average price for a gallon of regular in Miami over the past year. Last November, that number was at about $2 per gallon. Since then, it has soared to over $3 a gallon. So what's fueling the hike? One economics professor says it's complicated. The main uh, idea behind the the gasoline price increase is the global oil prices. He says we're seeing higher global demand for energy coupled with a production problem. These drill companies, they are having a hard time finding workers. Add to that the increase in demand we typically see over the holidays, and it could be well into next year before we see relief at the pump. If you are filling your tank every week, maybe twice a week, it means that you are you know, spending about maybe 300, 400 bucks a month. And if your income is about 2000 bucks, then it's a big portion of your income. That's why you may want to consider looking online for the best prices. If you are going to see a bunch of options and you can decide yourself which option is better for your budget. That's a good idea. I'll look if there is any way to get a, a better price. And there are several apps available to help you search for gas prices right on your phone. Gas Buddy gives you a sense of gas prices near where you are, showing you the lowest and the highest in your area. Gas Guru offers a similar service. The AAA app also shows you gas prices based on your location. Now, some of these apps tell you when the price you're seeing was reported, so make sure you look at that before heading out to a particular gas station, because if it's been a couple of days, there's a good chance the price could have changed. Alina Machado, NBC. Six response.